Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a plan with me in my Hobonichi Weeks Maaya Sakamoto collaboration. This is my favorite Hobonichi Weeks. These are the pens that we will be using for today. There's quite a few and the last one is a fountain pen from Kokuyo and Platinum Preppy collaboration. I got that from my stationary pal box and I'll link that haul down below to see all the wonderful Kukuya products. Speaking of subscription boxes or boxes in general, this clip is from a subscription box that I unboxed in another video and I'll link that down below as well. So here I'm starting to line the left page and after that I'm going to go ahead and line the, line the right page as well. So I'm using a Stadler Tripless Fine Liner in blue. Unfortunately, I don't know which pen color or type this is, but I'm pretty sure that you can easily find this amongst all of the different Stadler pens. After that, I'm going to write my headers. And this one is just a scribble of today. And I'm going to decorate that part by using my double liners. I don't really know what they're called um, and they're just fine liners that have two colors. And across that I have chores. So on the left side of the page I'm going to put down stickers and this is from the subscription box from the pencil case shop and they sent their box to me for free. I did unbox it and once again it's going to be down below. So this part of the left page is going to be for schedule, whereas the rest of the left page is going to be for lists or anything I want to note down. Mind that this is a personal planner, so not just personal the size, but this has all my family stuff and other personal stuff. So there are no work details here that goes into my Hobonichi Weeks Mega. I'll link the last plan with me down below. Also, the ink that I'm using is from Ferris Wheel Press. This is one of their newer inks um, releasing today, uh, June 3rd. So pick this up if you can. It's a wonderful ink. It has a green sheen, I think, but it is generally blue. It's very vibrant and highly pigmented, very easy to use. So here I'm just writing the details down in between the stickers that I am putting down. Now these stickers is not something that um, I would 100% recommend if you don't want your planner to bulk up because they are on the thicker side. If you've been watching my channel, you know that I prefer washi stickers or washi tapes themselves so that the pages aren't too bulky after I use them. So this is what I meant by using the rest of the left page as just lists and other notes. And then here at the bottom, I have my uh, Sunday event, which is going to be a filming day. So this is the left side complete, and now we can move on to the right side of the page. So here I'm putting down headers once again, and this is my currently list. So these are the three things that I'm either reading. So I'm reading a Terry Pratchett book, and shows that I'm watching. I'm watching one right now, and it's the Star Trek Strange New Worlds. It's wonderful. I highly recommend it if you are into Star Trek or sci-fi. And last is the game that I'm playing. So I'm playing Tunic right now. This is the second run. I've already finished the game, and I just wanted to play it some more. I did use that one sticker for my currently side. And this is just to note down my current favorites of the week. And then under that, I have my to-do list. So I'm only going to put down a few things here because I tend to have a lot of things that come up as I use these pages. 
so I like to um, keep some spaces blank for any new things that I need to list down in my to do's. After that, towards the bottom, I have my social media. And this has, of course, um, my general social media to do if there's any post that's needing to be posted. And then, of course, all the different social medias that I have. I have Instagram as well as YouTube. Basically, I only have two, but like Instagram has feed stories, reels, and then YouTube has the actual video and community, which I need to keep track of. And then, of course, I need to make my filming list under that. And it's going to be the usual, the Hobonichi Weeks, maybe Rings, maybe even Journal. I'm really not sure which of these I will be filming um, because there might be some things that I don't want to film. It depends really on my um, what I've decided for that day. So I hold it off for as long as I can. And then at the very bottom is next week because it wouldn't be a page that I've made if there wasn't any next week at the bottom. So that is our page for today. So it's still minimal, although we do have quite a few decorative elements on here. And of course, it's still super functional. These are the kind of pages that I'm gravitating to lately. And maybe in, in next video, I'm going to talk about my ring planners or my Hobonichi Weeks Mega. And I'll see you in that video.